Are you familiar with Edgar Wright? Then you probably know him for his fast cuts. I always thought they were a sort of parody of Requiem for a Dream. You know when they light up and get high? Compare this to Shaun of the Dead when he wakes up. Edgar Wright has made it his own thing. He uses this fun cinematic technique in his movies to create comedic scene transitions. However, notice how he uses many fast cuts together in a sequence. This serves to speed up a series of character actions and results in a scene transition. Here, he uses it to go from a fresh crime scene to a blocked off crime scene. Baby Driver is Edgar Wright's latest movie, and I was expecting his signature technique to be present here. Except it wasn't, at least not in the same way. On a second viewing, I noticed how whenever a character interacts with an inanimate object, we get a quick close-up. The vast majority of these are during car chases. We see close-ups when Baby switches gears, makes turns and such. But we also see them when people are interacting with other things, like loading a gun, picking up a grenade, and we also get them for less intense scenes, like when counting cash, or pressing an elevator button. The way Edgar Wright uses this technique here is a lot more refined than in his previous works. It isn't screaming attention to itself, but it still serves a similar function. A character interacts with an object, which results in a change in the scene. Even if it's something simple as picking up some coffee. Or something more significant as a door opening on a moving car. <laughs> 